Okay guys, here's a quick demonstration of what I've been working on. So the main goal is to build a dual or a bicopter with dual collective pitch helicopter heads. Uh, the final design will be with fly barless heads and with counter rotating blades all belt driven, driven off of one motor. Um, just for testing reasons I've hooked up all six servos of the swash plates to channels one through six on the CC3D. Um, set up my receiver and transmitter normally. Running the running everything off the BEC of this uh, unused uh, speed controller. It's rated at 5 volts and 2 amps. Making sure I don't over uh, overuse my battery. So I set it up so that when you the basic controls that I want are when you throttle up both swash, place it, swash plates increase the blade pitch on both heads. So on these helicopter heads, it's when you decrease the swash plate or lower the swash plate level, it increases the blade pitch as you can see. So that is the, as I throttle up, the blade pitch increases to fly forward, forward elevator. Both swash plates will tilt forward at an oblique angle, and the main goal of that is to utilize the gyroscopic precession. Uh, I've read a lot about that on uh, Gary Gress's Invader 600, and his uh, aircraft are all trying to utilize the gyroscopic precession. So I want to kind of design something that does that as well as uses the helicopter heads because I feel that helicopter heads have a lot more gyroscopic uh, force than fixed pitch blades do. Um, so this is the forward pitch. Both go forward together. Vice versa for reverse flight. So you can see maybe I can't tell if you can see so for roll I want to if I want to roll right instead of trying to slide the whole aircraft to the right I want to roll this way so I want to increase the pitch on my left head and decrease the blade pitch on the right head so as I go right the blades on the right go to negative pitch and the blades on the left go positive pitch and vice versa for going left roll. Now for yaw I want to be able to as it yaws I want the left if I wanted to yaw to the right I want the left head to steer forward and the right head to steer backwards. So this one as I yaw right, this one tilts forwards, that one tilts backwards. And vice versa, backwards and forwards for uh, left yaw. And all the controls work as you can move them all together and they mix them accordingly. So, so far, this is promising. I don't know if I'm just completely tricking myself and on the wrong track, but I'm amused that I could get it all to work the way that I imagined. So the next step is trying to find out if I can match my throttle curve of a motor and the pitch curves of what I've set in the GCS. Um, I'm thinking to not even run the motor through the copter control board and just run it straight to the uh, receiver. Um, also, I don't know if that'll work. This is just early stages. Um, one thing I'm confused about is why there is no... Um, I can even arm it here. 
why there is no gyro stabilization. I don't know if I just haven't set it up yet or if that doesn't work with the custom mixes or what, but hopefully I can get that to work. So that's probably my next step is to find out why, what the gyros are thinking right now or what they see. So we'll see how, that's kind of weird, it turned off. We'll see how that goes. All right. Thank you, Open Pilot, for an amazing flight controller and an amazing uh, GCS. Thanks.